What's up, my homies? I am at the Samsung Galaxy Station thingy in Best Buy. So yeah, I decided I want to do a quick review in the middle of the store. So this is the Galaxy Player 4.0, 8 gigabytes. Comes in white only. Take a look at that. I'll get back to that later. Um, starts off at 229. Just came out a couple months ago and got a 4.0 inch super clear LCD display, 3.2 megapixel rear camera with no LED flash. Unlike the five, the um, Galaxy Player 5.0 it does have a flash. This 4.0 does not have a flash. So it has built-in Wi-Fi and a VGA front-facing camera. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. As you see it just lit up for me saying battery fully charged. And this is running Android 2.3 Jumbo. As you can see by the top of the status bar. Um, just unlocked it. Take a look at the body. Got a 3.2 megapixel camera. On the top you have a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. Volume rockers here. Uh, see if I can find an SD card slot. Don't see when you got a little mic on the bottom. Uh, interestingly enough, I don't know if you guys can see that, you have a little grill on the front right here. I don't know what that's for, since being this is not a cell phone, I don't know why they would have a grill up there. Anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at the side, get your power and lock button, and I do not see a micro SD card slot anywhere on this. It's kind of disappointing, but yeah. So this is a media player. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at what it can do. So on the bottom you get your four icons. This is running TouchWiz 3.0 I think, by the way. Running on top of Gingerbread. You get your music, videos, internet. Go ahead and jump in there. Um, so here's the browser. Web page not available. Let's see if we can get some pinch to zoom in. Guess not. Um, pretty much all I can show you for now. Go back in there real quick. Um, here are your options. You can have windows open here. See here on the bottom, you got your home, back, and menu buttons. These are capacitive, and they are LED backlit. Um, it's one of my pet peeves. The buttons are backlit. Can't see them at night, and it kind of sucks. You can go ahead and scroll through. This is powered by a 1 gigahertz processor. Um, don't know specifically how much RAM. I think 256 megabytes. Got your Google search up here. Very nice keyboard. You also have um, enabled speech to text. So that's pretty cool. No internet right now, but it's pretty cool. Uh, let's see if I can see if there's swipe on here. Do you do it? Input method, and you do have swipe. Aha! I found it. Let's see if I can get back on the keyboard. And I know how to use swipe. Thank you very much. But here it is. You have swipe right here. Pretty awesome. I love swipe. Works very well for me. Go ahead and jump back out. So the screen looks absolutely gorgeous. Not very, not chunky looking, not gritty. Looks very nice. Stacking up against the retina display, it does look very good, especially be four inches. I think Apple can pull off a four inch iPhone 5 that comes soon. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and jump into music. So here's the music application. I don't know if you guys can see that, it's very dark, but you got these, oh here it is. Like an iPhone, um, iPhone's music app, you got these little letters here, you can go quickly to the, so the first letter of the um, song. You can have playlists up here, most recently played, recently played, all that. I'm going to take a look at the player UI. It's got some weird artwork going on here. Volume. Um, equalizer, it's kind of cool built in. Set some custom equalizations. Uh, go back to here. This the music now playing down here. Uh, little bar here. Shuffle, repeat, play, pause, next. And let's see if this plays in the background. Yep, it does play in the background. Shows up right here in the notification center. Pretty sweet stuff. Go so right there. Yeah. Let's see if we can find any video in here. Alright, so we got a little five second video. Um, Looks very nice, very clear, very surprised. Pretty cool. All right, it's five seconds, pretty much over. So yeah, that's pretty much what's it with the Samsung Galaxy Player 4.0. Go ahead and hit the thumbs up, subscribe, and thanks for watching, guys. Peace.